Hello traders, welcome to Allies Blue. This is the Ken Gogo, technical analyst of Allies Blue. So in this video, I will discuss about crude oil and here you can see this is a crude oil 15 minute chart, right? So yesterday uh, price was here, exactly, price just opened in a gap down, right? Yeah, here was the supporting zone, right? So I think remember uh, this one, this one a uh, supporting zone, right? Around 3798 and another is a 3738 so this was a supporting zone so we was looking for a buy signal but you can see according to me yesterday i told i was looking for a moving average crossover uh, this is seven moving average exponential and 20. i was looking for a buy opportunity but uh, you can see here we have never seen any buy opportunity because all moving average are arranging like that right we are looking for a cross moving average right so we never seen like that and they can see this was a CCI so I was looking for a cross CCI but we never seen any buy opportunity here so that is why I given another option here I was looking for here sell below this line around uh, 3738 uh, right so uh, in this zone I told that here was around uh, 50 point something was uh, in this zone so I was uh, not entering in this area because after breaking this supporting line, right? Uh, this candle you can see uh, this candle uh, close below this uh, supporting line and I placed my sell order here just uh, five to six point below this previous candle. So here you can see this is closing candle and I placed my sell order here and you can see here another thing I place uh, my SL was uh, my SL was around 42 point I think yeah 42 point something was there yeah so 42 yeah exactly here was my SL and uh, my target uh, my trading ratio was 1 is to 2 and my target was 80 uh, 80 somewhere here right somewhere here in this candle you can see uh, somewhere here and my SL was just above this candle and here was I think 40 44 or 45 point 45 point here I can see this is called 1 R this is called 1 R and uh, my take profit ratio was uh, somewhere 82 or 83 point was there and that is my R2 so, right so exactly they hit my target yesterday so right so if you want to enter today, so in which direction you can go for buy or sell. So that is why we have to find out support and resistance in the large time. So if you want to see in a daily, we can see here, uh, this was my trading zone, right? Uh, now, uh, previously this was a resist, uh, supporting zone, now it's becoming a resistance zone, right? So if I want to buy, so definitely I will go for buy above this zone. So here you can see 37898. Uh, if they break this level, definitely I'm I'm looking for a buy opportunity above this zone. And I'm looking for again sell opportunity below this uh raise 10 line. So that is why let me show you another thing. Uh, if you wanna see in a weekly chart, so I sometimes I use weekly chart for find out the support and resistance rate. Right? So according to weekly chart, we have seen the two, 200 moving average are here. Just let me a little more adjust this one. So now you can see I just uh, replaced my resistance line toward uh, seven or uh, three seven five uh, nine. So because here is a 200 uh, exponential uh, moving average, so that is why I place a horizontal line, right? So we have seen this is a resistance line right now. Now daily you can see the price just a little more gone up, right? And I'm looking for a sell opportunity because in a small time frame like daily they're creating lower low, lower high, right? Daily lower low, lower high, right? Lower low, lower high, like that. So here might be a lower high below this uh, resistance zone. So here you can see this is a resistance zone. So let me show you. Change the color. So now you can see this is our resistance zone. Are you see? 
uh, previously this was a supporting zone now it's become a resistance zone so i'm looking for a sell opportunity below this resistance zone right if they break this level so i'll go definitely i'll go for buy in between this area in between this area i never gonna take any position in this zone in between area so below this uh, resistance zone i am looking for uh, a sell opportunity in a daily right so now you can see yesterday i told this is the impulsive wave and corrective wave because still they are not confirming the trend will continue to our downside or it will reverse from this area so we never seen any trend reversal pattern right so trend reversal uh, sorry pattern means here we can see this is a, they are forming a double bottom pattern right? or most of the people are telling w pattern or some people are telling this is a butterfly pattern so according to their strategy okay so we never seen till now any uh, trend reversal pattern right so trend is running in a downtrend so we will definitely go for sell so that is why i'm looking for a sell signal in this area right so big question is there what trading strategy will use here right so that is why let let me check it in 15 minutes so now we can see first we have seen yesterday i told that the price is just following the moving average 20 have you seen just hit the moving average 20 and price fell down again here some given correction near 20 moving average fell down, right now you can see in a small time frame they're creating higher high and higher low have you seen this was previous lower low and after that they create a lower high here you can see this is called lower high lower high now you can see this is a higher high they are creating and looking for a retracement and the next target will be here somewhere like that right lower low lower high and the lower low and higher high right so i'm not interested uh, to buy any more in this area because this is a resistant zone right once they break this level so 200 moving average will be here like that and once they break this level after doing the retracement so i'll start buying above this uh, zone so here you can see the zone is like a 3798 and 200 moving average will be here so after that i'll buy and i'm looking for a sell signal below in this area All right i'm looking for a sell signal in this zone All right this is my uh, sell signal zone so here you can see this is my sell signal zone if I see, find any sell uh, signal like uh, some people are using candlestick patterns, some people are moving average crossover like that, moving average will be here and crossover, uh, CCI crossover and you can see like various type of candlestick pattern like uh, you can say like that uh, dozy pattern, right, dozy pattern, right and uh, inverted hammer pattern, uh, evening star and uh, black crow one black crow uh, that type of pattern angle thing pattern if i find any that type of pattern so suppose let me tell you uh, let me tell you one thing suppose i have seen a inverted hammer pattern right like that right here so i'll place a sell order below here and my sl will be here by doing money management right so this is my uh, sell entry and my target will be here somewhere here by doing my money management if this is one hour this area and uh, my target will be around 1.5 to uh, 2 hour right my target will be here somewhere right? so i hope you enjoy this video if you like this video please like and subscribe thanks for watching